Today I am showing you what's called, I believe I'm pronouncing correctly, Reparo. This is a CE certified, meaning it's rated for a specific type of protection, flannel. I ride one wheels a lot. I banged up my shoulder pretty bad several times. Quite frankly, I didn't want to wear football shoulder pads or anything else. I just prefer to be able to throw on something. I found this, put a link below exactly to this product. I'm just gonna say right off the bat, I am really, really impressed. Yes, it's a bit pricey. It's over a hundred dollars. The smallest they make, I'm a smaller guy, and I'm gonna say it actually fits pretty well. I'm gonna show you up close a few things about it, but so I was really concerned originally about the padding. Is it does it really does it really feel like it's gonna protect? And I can tell you right now that as you can see the padding is actually in here you can see it if you look there actually is velcro here you can actually take these out it appears you can remove you can remove all of them so if you wanted to take out the uh, back pad for example you know you can do that or put a different one in of course you want to check the measurements and the sizes of anything you order but that's another reason the value point on this is so good because you can take them out you could technically take them out and just wear this as a flannel because it's actually really, really nice. Heavy duty, and it's even got a coat hanger. You know, you can hang it up on a hook, which is super nice. Good. And I actually took my shoulder and banged up against the wall with it just to see how I, if I could feel it or what the impact was like. And I felt like it really did absorb the shock, so I'm pretty impressed. There's a back pad, two shoulder pads, and elbow pads. But the inside, my understanding, this is all Kevlar which is, as you can see here, the label says DuPont Kevlar fiber. So, and the whole inside of the jacket is covered in Kevlar. This was really thought out well, and it's just loaded with pockets. I mean, if you ride a motorcycle, one wheel, skateboarding, whatever it is, you've got pockets galore. I, I, this is obviously brand new. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, put it on so you can see how it fits. It, it's a little on the heavy side. I mean, it's not like heavy, heavy, but it, it's weighted a little because of the padding. And by the way, there's also zippers here, which is really nice because if you want to like roll up your sleeve a little, they just, this is just designed. I mean, it's better than any flannel I've ever owned in terms of functionality and pockets. Put this side on. I'm going to just loosen these. But again, on the sizing, so I hear all the comments that I read said always get a size up. I had to go with the smallest because I knew that um, I generally fit into smaller sizes. But if you look at this, it zips completely up. It's got buttons as well, so if I didn't want to use a zipper, I could just button it. I always look for quality, you know, when I'm trying something. I want to feel the fabric. I want to feel the buttons. And everything on this is just. It feels just really, really good quality. Everything is solid. The fabric is tight. It's stiff. I did wear it outside for a little bit, even the cool, and it's got, it's just, it is breathable a bit because of the, um, the vented Kevlar, but also it's just great for all weather. You know, I would say if, uh, maybe 50 to 70 degrees, you can get away with wearing this and it's comfortable. But anyway, as you can see, the shoulder pads are here. They're up here. They go right over the shoulder and, I, and they're actually adjustable. That's one thing about it too. They, they're actually, uh, there's space to move them around so they, you can get the pads right over your shoulders. So if I'm out riding, uh, as well as the elbow pads, I can adjust those a bit. If I'm out riding, I would just wanna make sure that you know everything's in a good position because if I do wipe out, I, I want the impact to come in on that. But I'm gonna say, this to me is a five-star item, 100%. Again, the price is high. That's the only downside. I think it was 130 bucks, but I expect this to last for years. I mean, even if I rack on this, hit my shoulder and you know, bang this up, I don't really care about that. If it's torn up a little bit, it doesn't really matter to me. You can't really get much cooler than this with protection. So link below, I did write up some other details about it. If there's any other questions you have, feel free to leave a comment. I'd be happy to talk about that. But again, like, just look at all these pockets on the inside. Another pocket. I mean, it's just pockets galore on this thing. So check out the back real quick too. So you can see there's a padded, you can see, the, I don't know if you can see the pad in the back, but I'm pulling it kind of tight so you can see. 
but there is back protection as well. And uh, again, it's all CE rated. I believe it's CE1. You wanna check the link below directly to the manufacturer on Amazon to see exactly. I believe it's CE1, I don't have it right in front of me. I did buy this as well because I wanted to be able to wear something under my other hoodies that I like wearing when I'm riding. This is by Wicked Stock. This, the, the padding in this is actually, seems a little thicker than in this. What's cool about this is I can wear this under anything else. And the price point on this is really good. This has the elbows, the shoulders, and the back as well. So if you're on a price point, I'm just gonna say, why don't I go ahead and throw it on real quick, just since we're doing this. But in terms of style, comfort, coolness, everything, hands down, this flannel just, this Reparo just kicks butt. This, or something, it's a little interesting. This is a little different. There's, I, I was reading a lot of the reviews and I think I read somewhere that someone said their skin got irritated from the fabric and you know, maybe there's a chemical in it or something. I don't know, but I'm wearing, um, I'm obviously wearing a shirt. Again, this is a size small, it's the smallest I could get that was available. But just check this out, fully padded. I can just put, I can put my favorite hoodie on, my favorite flannel, whatever it is. I can wear it right over this and I get the same protection. That's why I say, if you don't wanna spend the money on that whole thing, you can just get this and just put your favorite shirt on over it and you don't have to worry about wasting the extra money on it. Because I feel, I feel like these pads are actually a little thicker even, and they're, they feel a little more shock absorbent than those. I might end up even wearing this first on some of my faster rides just to, just in case I fall on my shoulder and see how this works out. Yeah, this thing is awesome. Link below, all data. I hope this was helpful guys. And this again, this is uh, CE rated as well. Uh, the brand is Wicked Stock. I would recommend either of these, really, I would. Again, this one, price point and I do feel like the padding is a little more, it just feels a little thicker and it take, I can just press on it. I feel like it takes impact a little better than that padding. That's just the way I see it right now. So thanks for watching. You guys have a great day and hope this was helpful.